Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I hope you had a wonderful Christmas, spent with loved ones, ate lots of food, and got a lot of presents. I'm sorry I got this video up a day late, but if you want to see how to get this look, then just keep watching. <laughs> like this half of my face done with foundation and highlight and stuff um, i took off my foundation because it just kept getting fallout from this look so i've never done this before i've never like done my eyes first and then my foundation because i don't know i i just don't understand how people can do this i usually put foundation on first and then do everything else i i, I... <laughs> we're gonna try this out today because I'm not trying to wipe this off again because I already wiped it off once. <sighs> I just didn't like how it turned out. So I'm going to go into my Saharan palette by Juvia's Place. Dip into Jamila with this fluffy brush right here. And I'm just going to go into my crease up to my brow bone. Now I'm going to go into... Oh, shit. So now I'm going to go into my Masquerade palette also by Juvia's Place. Zulu with this flat blending brush. And I'm going to go into my crease. I'm going to take my first blending brush and just kind of blend those two colors together. Now I'm going back into the Saharan palette and picking up Chad with this detailed brush. And I'm just going to outline where I want my new crease to be. And I'm going to do this with my eyes open since I do have hooded lids. I want my new crease to be above that. And then I'm going to connect this to make like a cat eye. Now I'm switching to this sparse tapered brush and I'm just gonna blend this out a little bit. I'm gonna dip a little bit into Zulu again to help me blend this out. Now it's time for the glitter and I'm using NYX's glitter primer. To apply that, I'm using this flat brush. Gonna fill this whole area inside the black. For the glitter, I'm using this gorgeous color by Lit Cosmetics. It's called Soul Sister. Taking the glitter primer that's remaining on my brush and dipping into this little cap with the glitter. switching between my detailed brush and sparse tapered brush um, add a little bit more black into the crease to define it a little bit more and then blend it out with my tapered brush I'm gonna dip into Zulu again which is that dark brown shade with my little tapered brush I'm gonna take my flat blending brush again and dip into Jamila, which is that orange shade. Now I'm gonna clean off my flat brush that I used for the glitter, and I'm gonna go to Wada Wa Wadabi, which is this shimmery green, and I'm going to highlight my inner corner. I should probably finish my foundation. So I'm gonna do that off camera and then I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm baking because I don't want any of this black eyeshadow to stain my foundation again. Going back to that color Wadabi, or I don't know how to pronounce it, but that green shade, I'm gonna put that in my brow bone. Oh shit. That is very pigmented, very pigmented. Blend this out a little bit. I'm also going to put that shade in my inner corner. That's just not bright enough for me, so I'm gonna go into my Ultimate Glow Kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Into snow, and just go a little bit in the inner corner. There you go. Add a little bit of that to my brow bone as well. For the bottom eyes, I'm gonna go into Jamila again, my tapered flat brush. Then 
then I'm gonna go into Zulu, which is that darker brown shade with my small tapered brush. I'm gonna go back into some black. off this powder set my face a little bit I don't know why I set my face just now I am just a really hot mess today um, I did contour so I'm gonna contour right now Now I'm gonna add these lashes by Morphe Brushes and these are so glamorous. And I'm also gonna use these individual lashes by Andrea and I'm gonna use these for the bottom. I'm probably just gonna use about four or five on each side. All right, just finished putting on blush and some lip gloss. This is the ColourPop Cosmetics Ultra Glossy Lip or something like that in WeHo and it'll be in the description box below. But yeah, this is the final look. That is it for this tutorial. I hope you liked this video. And if you did, please give this video a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. Stay caked, stay fierce, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.